I'm gonna show you how to create a custom border right within Lightroom like this. This is a question from a student in one of my photography courses over at videoschoolonline.com. So basically what you need to do is find the photo that you want to add the border to. Select it right within your panel down at the bottom. And then it's a good idea to note the dimensions. So if you go under the metadata, you can see that the dimensions of this image are 5,472 by 3,648. This is basically a four by six photo. And so that's just good to note because the next step is to go to the print tab. Here is where we can add our actual border. What we need to do though is we have these different templates on the left hand side for creating sort of a printout. We're going to need to create a custom page setup. So click page setup in the bottom left. Go to the drop down under paper size and choose manage custom sizes. Then create a paper size that is six inches wide by four inches tall or whatever the aspect ratio of your photo is. So I'm going to call this four by six. And this is a pretty good aspect ratio. It's a pretty good size for printing out. If you need a higher resolution, you could just duplicate this or double the size. So 12 inches by eight. I'll show you how actually big this is in pixels once we're done. And then click OK. So this is what happens. The next thing we need to do is increase the size of our photo. So over here on the right hand side under layout size, what we're going to do is turn the stroke on. So now we see that there's a black stroke and we could increase or decrease the size of the stroke with the slider right here. So say we want a 10 point stroke, we can type in 10 and we'll change that to white later if you want a white one. But this still isn't the size of our paper. So first we're going to get rid of all of these margins under layout. So decrease all the margins like this. And then what we're going to do is just increase the size of our image. So just increase the sides by clicking on the edges and dragging to the full width of the page. If we had margins, it wouldn't let us do that. That's why we decrease the margins to zero. Now we have this border, so we can change the color if we want a white border, a black border, or anything in between with this color picker down here. Then scroll down to the right, and under print job, change from printer, which you probably have it on, to JPEG file. And here is where you could set your settings. You can increase the resolution if you want right here. Make sure that the JPEG quality is at 100, unless for some reason you want it lower and then click print to file. This will ask you where you want it. So I'll just type in Joshua tree, click save. And now in our finder, we have this image saved with a border right on it. And the dimensions, if I open up my information, are 1800 by 1200 pixels. So if you want it to be twice that size or, or bigger, just play around with the size of the paper settings and that will increase. You could also play around with the file resolution down here. One thing I do want to note though is at the top of your settings over here under image settings is this zoom to fill option. And you see that when I uncheck this, it actually zooms out from the photo just a little bit. And that is making sure that it has the original aspect ratio of the photo, which is just ever so slightly off of the four by six ratio. So if you want it specific, you're going to have to change the page settings. But since four by six is a pretty standard print for your photo size, that's what I use when I save mine with a border like this. And I do make sure to check zoom to fill so that the border size is the same width all the way around. Cool, I hope this answers your question. If you were looking to figure out how to add a border in Lightroom, let me know if you have any questions in the comments and I look forward to serving you in the future with more tutorials. Bye.